Hi, I will introduce you Swing Brushless version of Turbine Basic Operation. This is Turbine Body. The yellow plug is for Turbine Wire. This is Fuel Fitter. When we install a Turbine, the Fuel Fitter must at the top. V3 ECU brushless pump display unit GSU the turbine wire is with two same yellow plug and uh, this is pump wire two different yellow plug throttle wire and the power battery cable Let's connect all wire. We take the turbine wire. One side plug in the turbine connector. Another side we connect to the ECU engine port. And this is pump wire. We take the pump. And another side, we connect to ECU pump port. And this is throttle wire. We connect to PPM input. And the another side, we connect to the receiver throttle channel. And finally, the power cable, we connect to the ECU. And this side connect to power battery. When we finish all connection, we need to prepare two battery. The power battery we use a 3S depot. The capacity recommend to use 2,500 to 3,000. When we connect the power battery, the issue and the display not working because we need to provide another battery to the receiver. We use a 2SD port battery. And now it's working. We can select English language from the menu. We can use the menu test function to test all component. Test the pump, the pump will spin. Test the fuel valve. We can hear the sound from the turbine. Test the gas valve. Test the starter. We use the test function to test all components of turbine. It's working good. Now we need to set up Start ERC. We move to the menu, Start ERC. You can read the green text, green number. When we move throttle stick up, the number will increase. When we move down, the number will down. The minima means throttle down and idle down, train down to minima. Double click OK. Then we need to set up the idle, throttle down, and the train up. Double click again. Then throttle up to maxima. Double click again. Now we finish the setup. When we try to start the engine, trim down 
and the throttle down means stop. <coughs> throttle down and train up, it will display ready. Then throttle up, then throttle down, the engine start to ignition. When we wish to stop the engine, train down. It's a finish a running cycle. And please note, when train down and the throttle up, the engine will cooling. When we want to start up the engine, train up, it will display ready. Then throttle up, then throttle down, the engine will ignition. After that, we train down, the engine will become stopped.